My name's Adrian Lane, I'm 52 from Colford in Gloucestershire and I'm an amateur radio operator. I spoke to the International Space Station in October of last year. Um, I can't remember the astronaut I spoke to but um, basically um, I waited for a pass of the International Space Station over where I live, uh, got the frequencies off the internet, managed to get the radio up, tuned up in time for the pass over um, my home and um, basically was sat there waiting ready. Obviously there is lots of other operators trying to get through to the ISS. Um, I was fortunate enough to do so towards the end of the pass and managed to get 45 seconds in before I lost the signal. Uh, got inspired to do it about a year before I actually did and on and off attempts had failed and managed to get it right in October. I literally said to him, you know, how do the stars look from, from up there and everything's so black and uh, he turned around and he said, well the stars are so much clearer up here because you, we're not looking at them through an atmosphere like you are and everything is so dark but yet when you look down at earth it's just like a blaze of colour. He said it's absolutely amazing Adrian. Yeah. I spoke to them for about 40 to 45 seconds. Basically we started to lose the pass, signals were fading, I think we, we, we made one last attempt to um, make contact again and we didn't manage to establish contact because literally as soon as I lost them they did come back slightly and we heard them talking to somebody else, they'd obviously moved on to the next one. If you get something like a basic Yagi, like this is what we call a Yagi, which is a beam. Um, this is a radiating element here which transmits the frequency. This is a reflector that points it all to the front. And these three are the um, directional guides for the frequency. So wherever you point that, you will literally um, receive signals. And the other thing is, if you were to get a handheld and connect a handheld to this, bear in mind this is a basic Yagi, probably costs you 30 or 40 pounds, with a handheld off eBay. You, you you can work the satellites, which is as, as good as working the ISSS to a degree, um, but it's an achievement. You can speak to other hands anywhere within the footprint of the satellite you're talking, you're, it's relaying you through. Um, basically, if it can see 350 kilometers or 400 kilometers of ground, you can contact people within that distance through the satellite once you get to it.